As Long Island reopens, a summer hot spot is trying to find its place in the new normal. Fire Island Pines grappling with how to deal with tourism and safety. Joining us now is PJ McAteer of Fire Island Commercial Properties. Thank you so much for your time. Tell us about, uh, you know, how are you dealing with the new normal here? Um, well, our first position is we're trying to keep both our staff and our guests as safe as possible. We are slowly opening as much as we can as we're able to. We are currently in phase three, so we have some of the restaurants opened. Uh, tomorrow night, Thursday, we open the third restaurant for indoor seating at 50% capacity and tables spaced at seven feet apart. So how do people get there um, You know, in this, in this pandemic time? Currently, Sable Ferry is running a, a, a great schedule. They're bringing people back and forth that you must wear a mask when you get on the ferry. Okay, so what is open? We, I mean, it's, it's a tourism spot, so what, what should we expect when we get there? We are doing table tea, which you are coming in, come into the restaurants, the Blue Whale, the Sip and Twirl Bar, uh, around the pool. You come in, you sit at a table, you can have a drink at the table when you're sit sitting without your mask on. If you're walking around the buildings or the, the properties or the decks, you must have a mask on. So that is going, we have uh, DJs, every day of the week okay mm -hmm. the um handsome store which is our hair cutting shop is open the camp store which is our nursery and flower shop is also open the general store which is clothing and sunglasses and jewelry and all kinds of fun tchotchkes is also open okay. again all of them are working in the phase three guidelines that are set up by governor cuomo all right pj mcintyre fire island commercial properties thank you so much for your time